Let me guess, you've been thinking about investing in Dubai for some time, but you haven't because you don't know much about the market. In that time, property prices have increased by 42% and you're sat there thinking, why didn't I just invest in Dubai? In this video, I'll be revealing everything you need to know about Dubai, including how much money you need to invest in Dubai, what are the best areas to invest in, and what are the hidden fees you need to factor in before you buy. Starting off with one of the biggest roadblocks people face is thinking they need millions of dollars if they want to invest in Dubai real estate. That's because all you hear about Dubai is the rich and the famous who party and buy real estate which is worth millions of dollars. And that's true, you have some of the wealthiest individuals in the world who are pouring their money into Dubai real estate. This includes the second richest man in India who bought two mega mansions on the Palm Jumeirah totaling $168 million. I know it's absolutely insane, but what's even more insane is that you can purchase Dubai real estate for less than $100,000. Yes, you might not be able to afford a mega mansion on the Palm, but there are still options you can buy. For example, there's very attractive off-plan investments where you pay the developer directly as the property is being constructed. This minimizes the risk because you don't need to put a lot of money up front. In actual fact, I'm currently working with a high net worth individual who wants to test out the Dubai market with a small investment before growing his property portfolio. So before you think you don't want to take the risk of investing millions in Dubai, there are options available where you don't need to spend as much money. Now let's talk about what often gets investors overwhelmed, which is where do you invest your money in Dubai? Because what people don't realize, Dubai is not like a traditional city like London, where you've got a central district and the rest of the city spreads out from that center. But in Dubai, there are two distinct central districts that I'm about to break down. So you have a Sheikh Zayed Road which runs through the center of Dubai and at either end you've got the Dubai Marina and downtown. Downtown is a major commercial district and that's where you find the world's tallest building, shopping destinations and the financial district of Dubai. So to put it simply, downtown is more of a New York style vibe with high skyscrapers, very metropolitan, and lots of business activities taking place. The second district that I've been talking about is 20 minutes away with no traffic, and that's the Dubai Marina and the Palm Jumeirah area. This is a major tourist destination where you find the resorts, the nightlife, and the beaches. And this area has more of a Miami vibe. So these two commercial districts should be a starting point when you are looking to invest in Dubai. And when you start heading eastwards from these two destinations, that's where you start getting the townhouses and the villas, which are effectively the suburbs of Dubai and that's where the families want to be. So I'm sure you're thinking, what is the best area to invest in? And that completely depends on your budget and your investment goals. If you're feeling overwhelmed by which area to invest in, book a call in the link below and I'll be more than happy to help. There is one thing that stresses investors out more than anything else and that's when they decide to invest in a property and they haven't factored in all the other hidden costs which are associated with buying property in Dubai. As a general rule, you need about 7% of a property's value to spend on fees alone. For example, if you're purchasing a property worth 2 million dirhams, you will need 140,000 dirhams to spend in fees alone. These fees broken down are a 4% fee to the Dubai Land Department, a 2% fee to the agent, a 0.5% of the loan value, and 0.5% on other administrative charges. So so before you calculate your budget of how much you can afford to purchase in Dubai, make sure you factor in all these hidden fees. And if you're interested in finding out what are some of the best investments of 2024, watch this video here and don't forget to like and subscribe.